All right, let's give the Lord one more hand clap today. Anybody ready for Power Week out there? Oh, it's going to be a good week. Tell you, Prophet Gustavo is going to minister in a moment. It's going to be incredible. And that he'll be back tonight and tomorrow night. And then Pastor Daniel Bracken, extremely prophetic man of God, moves in signs and wonders. I remember I had him at a... Uh, uh, tent meeting out in Kentucky. Last time I had him over there, uh, he got somebody that couldn't walk, hadn't walked in like 20 years up out of a wheelchair walking. Come on, somebody. How many know God is still moving? He's currently building the largest church house in the state of Alaska. Ministered up there not, not long ago. So uh, I want everybody to get their expectation up, get your hope up. Come on. How many know our God's still the same yesterday, today, and forever? So let, let's get faith. I, I feel some faith in the atmosphere. Jesse and I are glad to be back. Came back from preaching the gospel in upstate New York at a political meeting. I like to take the flag and point people to the cross. Saw a couple hundred people born again uh, just on Friday night. And God, God's moving and using his church to influence people in some of the highest levels of government. And I want you to continue to pray for us. How many know we got we to redeem the world? How many think we need to redeem leadership? When the righteous rule, the people rejoice. Amen? So we're, we're praying for that. But I, I'm so excited to have my, my dear friends here and uh, so thankful that Prophet Gustavo's here, Pastor Ricardo as well. Uh, I love them, their family. Uh, Prophet, Prophet Gustavo told me years ago that a church gets to pick who will be their prophet, right? Uh, people are assigned, you pick, and you, you, you receive that gift into your life. And we've chosen to receive Prophet Gustavo as one of the prophetic voices that, that helps this church. The miracles we've watched flow, the people's lives we've been touched through, through his ministry uh, just has blown my mind as a pastor. And it's an honor to have these men with us. Why don't y'all give the prophet and Pastor Ricardo a big hand clap as they come to minister the word of God. Come on. Amen. Amen. Al tamaño de tu aplauso será tu milagro. At the level of your applause will be your miracle. Y al tamaño de tu grito de júbilo será tu victoria. At the level of the shout of praise will be your victory. Creo que esta gente está despierta. Vamos por acá a ver. I, I think they're they're awake. Let's see. Al tamaño de tu Let's grito de júbilo here. será tu victoria. At the, at the level of your shout of praise will be your victory. Y al tamaño de tu aplauso será tu milagro. And at the level of your applause will be your miracle. Amen. Amen. You may be seated. Gracias, Pastor. Por Thank you, Pastor. Eh, es permitir que nosotros tengamos el honor de predicar Thank en este altar. Thank you for altar. allowing us the honor to preach this morning in Sie this house. Siempre he aprendido I learned que uno como pastor no trae cosas regulares, siempre trae lo mejor, a la mejor comida, a la I mejor. I learned, you know, as a pastor that you always bring the best of the best to your house. Y cuando uno va a un lugar, so when you go to a place y siempre va con la disposición de dar lo mejor. You always go with the heart to give him the best. Ayer viajé casi 15 horas. I traveled for 15 hours yesterday. 6 horas en avión. 6 hours by plane. De Bogotá a Houston. From Bogotá to Houston. Y después esperar 3 horas. And then I waited for 3 hours. Y después de Houston aquí. And then I flew from Houston to here. Ya llegué sin saber quién era. And so when I came here I didn't know who I am, who I was. I'm Puedo sorry. Sacar la cédula y preguntar quién soy uh, yo. I saw my passport and I was like who, who I am I don't remember who I am La pregunta es, ¿por qué Dios mueve un but why God moves a prophet ¿Para qué Dios mueve un what's the purpose that God is moving a prophet todo lo que tú ves con un because everything that you see starts with a prophet ¿Cómo te ama tanto Dios a ti? God loves you so much que te trae una persona que tú no conoces. that he brought someone that doesn't know you Porque te ama. because he loves you para decirte just to tell you que tus hijos that your children le servirán al Señor they will serve the Lord que no te preocupes don't worry anymore porque ellos le servirán because they will serve the Lord que tus lágrimas your tears tu dolor your pain lo que has tenido que pasar what you've been going through estos días 
these past days no ha sido fácil. It hasn't been easy. Pero Dios me trajo para But God brought me here today to tell you que todo va a estar bien. that everything's going to be okay. Estás llorando por una persona. You've been crying for one person. Y preocupado por una and persona. you've been worrying for that person. Que está cautiva. And I see that person like uh, that person has been captive. Pero Dios va a ser But God is going to make a miracle. Ven acá, Come por here. Favor. Come here. <clears throat> o sea, ¿cómo te ama Dios? So that's how God loves you. Que Dios te trae that he brought para sanarte someone here just to heal you para hablarle a una mujer to talk to a lady y decir, Todo va a salir bien. and to tell her that everything is going to be okay Hoy estoy sanando tu cuerpo. I am healing your body says Hay the una Lord mujer llamada María también. and there is a lady and her name is Maria y el Señor me dice, and God tells me Yo soy tu respuesta. I am the answer for you quién vino ella? Who, came, who came with you this morning Aplauda al Señor. Come on, put your hands together. Sí. Ella está preocupada por por ella. She's been worried about her as well. Dile, todo saldrá bien. Tell her everything's going to be okay. Everything's going to be okay. Todo está bien. Everything's going to be okay. Everything's going to be okay. Tú sabes que ella fue un milagro de Dios. Do you know that she was a miracle from God? Ella no debía haber nacido. She was not supposed to be here this morning. Nació antes de tiempo. Because she was born before time. Pero Dios la tiene con un propósito. But God brought her with a purpose. Entonces, mover un profeta. So for a prophet to come where para you are. Ella, valió la pena haber venido. You know, just to tell her that it was worth it. Hay un milagro de Dios para There is a miracle for you. Hay sanidad para There ti. is healing for you. Sanidad para ti. Healing for Te tengo you. Una buena noticia. I have good news. Antes del día miércoles, Before Wednesday, tú vas a recibir ese milagro. you will receive that miracle. Yo estaría alegre, ¿no? I, I will be happy if I heard y that. Los hijos estarían alegres. <laughs> ¿Qué sientes? What do you feel? <laughs> really good. Good. Me siento bien. ¿Te imaginabas que Dios te iba a hablar hoy? Did you imagine that God was going to talk to you this morning? Not at all. No, nunca. Voy a, voy a hablarte algo más. And I'm going to tell you something else. Cierra tu corazón. Close your heart. Porque hay una persona que te hizo daño. But because there is a person that hurt you. Y necesitas perdonarla hoy. And you need to forgive that person. ¿Sabes de qué estoy hablando? Do you know what I'm talking about? Huh? Sí. Okay. Yes. Hasta okay. ahí paro. So, uh, I'm going to stop right there. Ahora, quiero que hagas algo. So, I want you to do something. Oh, quiero que vayas y busques a quien tú quieras. I que want no, you to go que ojalá que no conozcas. into the crowd and choose one person that you don't know. Ve, pero que no conozcas. And bring that person here. Y me la go. traes. Go. Que no conozcas. Someone that you don't know. Y, y voy a dar el mes de julio. And I'm going to say this month of July. Voy a, voy a, voy a dar la J. Letter J. Una J tiene que ver contigo. And that's related with you. Con, con quién estás? Who came with you? ¿Quién es ella? Su novia. ¿Tú la conoces a ella? ¿Cuándo cumple años tú? When is your birthday? July 7th. When? July 7th. Huh? July 7th. July 7th, okay. Yo, yo, yo dije que iba a haber una J. I said letter J, remember? Yeah. Y dije que el mes de julio. And I said the month of July. Pero tú no me has contado el cumpleaños. But you never told me your birthday before, did you? Tú no me has contado eso. You never told Pero me. Pero ahora that. yo digo. But now I said this. Que el mes de julio tiene que ver con ustedes. Julio, el mes de The month of July is related with you. Y Dios va a abrir una puerta. And God is going to open a door. Voy a contarte una historia. I'm going to share a story with you. Él ha pasado por dos pérdidas emocionales. He lost twice emotionally. Y Dios va a restituir su vida emocional. But God is going to bring restitution to his ha estado cansado. life. He's been tired. Dios ha cuidado su vida. God took care of you in the past. Dos veces Dios le ha guardado la vida. Twice God got your life. Veo como Dios te ha, ha puesto como un ángel 
alrededor tuyo and para I see cuidarte. how God you know, has put an angel around your life y vi una mujer orando por and ti. I saw a lady and she was praying for you una señora, a hasta lady cuenta como si fuera ella. like her como una mujer anciana. A, a, a older lady. Y Dios te ama. And God loves you. Él, él, él te está buscando. And he's been seeking for you. Voy a decirte algo más. And I'm going to tell you something else. Ella te ama. She loves you. Ella te ama. She loves Quiero you. Quiero que estés claro de eso. I want you to, you know, know that that Porque she loves si you. Si tú sabes que ella te ama. Because if you know that she loves you, es un poco eh, posesiva. Sometimes she's a little bit possessive. Pero, pero es buena. But she's a good person. Pero, pero te ama. And she loves you. No le vayas a hacer daño. Don't hurt her. Porque también la han herido. Because she's been hurt in the past as well. Abraza. Hug each other. Oh, alguien tiene que adorar a Somebody needs to worship God. ¿Qué sientes? What do you feel? Good. The end is great. Antes del día jueves, before Thursday, va a haber un milagro en la vida de ustedes. A miracle will come to your lives. Y va a haber un milagro financiero. And a financial miracle is coming to you. Eso va para ti también. And that's coming to you as well. Y veo el mes de septiembre. And I see the month of September. Hay una celebración ahí. Like a celebration. I see like a celebration. Y veo un niño. And I see a boy, a little boy. Y voy a parar ahí. And I'm going to stop right there. <laughs> Alguien tiene que aplaudir. Somebody needs to worship God. <clears throat> ¿Con qué vienes? Who came with you? Who came with you? Your parents? They're here? Los papás están acá. Tú tienes un llamado hermoso. You have a beautiful call all over your life. Desde niña fuiste un milagro. Since you were a little girl, ¿Dónde están you tus were padres? a miracle. Where are your parents? Ah, es el papá. Yo he orado por ustedes alguna Did vez. Did I pray for you before? Sí. Yes. ¿Cuándo? When? Uh, every Cada time, vez que vengo. Every time you come, <laughs> you pray for us. <laughs> yo, yo voy a contarles algo. I'm going to share this with you. Oro por tanta gente. I pray for a lot of people. Todos los días. Every single day. Que yo le hice un trato a Dios. And I made a deal with God. Que se me olviden. I told him, God, I want to forget. Las personas por las que yo oro. The people that I pray for. Que solo me acuerde. I only want to remember. De los que me honran. The ones that honor me. Hello. Hello. Diga todo lo que yo honre. Everything that I honor with my life lo atraigo. I will attract it to my life Entonces hay gente que dice, so there's people usted sabe quién es Jordan, that sometimes they say do you know who, who Jordan is? Ah, sí, Jordan. and I can say yeah I know who Jordan él, is él me recogió he picked me up la primera vez the first time en una bomba de gasolina. In a, at a gas station y me trajo a Amarillo. and he brought me to Amarillo y cuidó de mí. and he took care of me, él me honró. so he honored me eso no se me olvida. So I will never forget that. Entonces yo cuido a él. So I know who he is. Porque me honra. Because he honors me. Hay gente que dice, usted me dio una palabra profética. There are people, you know, they will come to me and say, you gave me a prophetic word. Y se cumplió. And, and, and the word that you gave me, you know, was fulfilled. ¿Se acuerda? Do you remember? No. I don't know. I ¿Por don't. qué? Why? Porque nunca me honraste. Because you never came back and honored me. Nunca me llamaste para decir gracias. You never called me to say thank you. Aquí tengo una ofrenda. Here's an offering for you. Hello. Hello. Todo, diga conmigo, todo lo que yo So honre, say with me everything that I honor with my life. Lo atraigo a mi I will vida. attract it to my life. Todo lo que yo honre, everything that I honor. Se queda en mi vida. It will stay in my life. Por eso es tan importante That's why it's so important que tú honres a tus padres. That you honor your parents. Tú vas a ser una profeta impresionante. You're going to be a great prophetess. Vas a ir a naciones. You will travel to the nations. Vas a predicar la palabra. You will preach the word. Vas a adorar a Dios. You will worship God. Hay otra niña. Is there another Pequeña. girl? La, la, la yeah, estoy viendo. Seis años. I, I can see her right now. Corre por todo lado. And she runs all over the place. <laughs> Is that her? Y yes. 
sí. y siento en mi espíritu and I feel in my spirit que ella va a ser la del billete la del negocio that she's gonna be the money maker ella va a financiarla a ella she's gonna finance you o sea va a haber un rompimiento económico so there's gonna come a financial breakthrough for vive, your life vive el Señor hoy vive como vive Jehová Dios lives God today que que Dios este año los va a bendecir económicamente tanto. God is going to bless you financially this year. Que va a haber tanta bendición por causa de ella. You will have so much blessing because Porque of her. Porque tú me estás sirviendo. Because you are serving me, says the Lord. Y cuando tú le sirves a Dios, estás honrándolo. When honrándolo you serve God, you are honoring Him. Estás honrándolo. You are honoring Him. Viene una noticia. Good news are coming. Algo de Houston, Texas. Something from Houston, Texas. Y va a haber un negocio de una empresa. And I see like a business. Y va a haber un contrato. And oh, like a contract. La profecía vale un billete. Oh, this prophecy worth a lot of money. Es, I'm telling you. Y Dios te va a abrir la puerta. And God is going to open the door. Y vas a quedar aterrado con lo And que you will be surprised. Hay un hombre llamado for Juan. For everything that you will receive, there is a guy named Juan. ¿Lo conoce? Do you know him? Hay Juan. Juan, tu tío, your uncle. Pero es una conexión. But this one is a connection. Y Dios te va a proveer. And God will provide. De negocios que nunca te habías imaginado. Business that you never imagined before. Oh, hay una unción para negocios. There is an anointing for business this morning. Con tu mano en el vientre de ella hay sanidad. Pray for her in her womb. There is healing. Eres mi profeta, hija. You are my prophetess. Hay una unción Daughter, ministerial. En there is an anointing for ministry in your life. There is a prophetic anointing as well. Se desata el poder de la unción. The power of the anointing has been released. El poder released. de la unción sobre tu vida. It's been released over your life. Algo grande empieza a ocurrir. Something big is happening right now. Yo estoy por ti. I am with you. Dice el Señor. Says the Lord. Yo peleo tu batalla. I am fighting your battles. Yo soy tu esposo. I am your husband. Yo soy tu amigo. I am your friend. Quiero leer rápidamente un versículo. I want to read a verse in the Bible. En la máxima profeta es la Biblia. Which is the perfect prophet. No, no hay, no hay un profeta más grande There que la Biblia. There is no other prophet like the Bible. No, no hay nadie, no hay más. There is poder. no one else like the Bible. Dice en Génesis 37, léelo. Génesis 37, verse 3. Now Israel loved Joseph more than any of his other sons because he had been born to him in his old age and he made an ornate rub for him. Le hizo una túnica. Amaba, amaba, Dios, amaba Jacob a José. Jacob loved Joseph. Lo amaba. He loved him. Lo amaba. He loved him. Voy a repetirlo de nuevo. And I'm going to say it again. He loved him. Lo amaba. He loved him. Ahora, el día que a ti se te revele cuánto te ama Dios. When you receive the revelation of how much God loves you. Tú dejarás tus miedos y tus temores. You will stop, you know, being afraid of things. Dice y Jacob amaba and Jacob loved a José. Joseph porque de tal manera amó Dios al mundo. Because God loved the world so much. Él te ama. He loves you. Vengo a decirle a alguien. I came to tell someone this morning how Dios. much God loves you. Dios no te ama porque tú eres bueno. And he doesn't love you because of who you are. Dios no te ama porque eres santo. He doesn't love you because you're holy. Dios te ama porque él es bueno y porque eres santo. He loves you because he is good. Dios me ama a mí. He loves me. No porque yo me porte bien. No because I behave good. Él me, él me ama porque él es bueno. He loves me because he is good. Ahora, cuando a mí se me revela. So when I get the revelation of the love of God. El amor de Dios. His love. Yo vivo para él. I live for him. Camino para I él. I work with him. Soy de él. I belong to him. Nada me detiene. Nothing can stop Porque me. Porque él me ama. Because I know that he loves me. Camino en su amor. I walk in his love. Camino en su vida. I walk in his life. Porque él me ama. 
because he loves me Quiero decirte en esta hora cuánto te ama. I want to tell you this morning how much God loves you. Yo tengo hijos como ustedes. I have sons like you. ¿Cuántos tienen hijos? How many of you are parents here? Adolescentes. The parents of teenagers, raise your hands. Que están pasando la gran tribulación. That you're going through the great tribulation right now. Que son monosílabos, son 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 monosílabos. Una sola palabra, apenas dicen, sí. All they say is just one word. Yes. How are you? Yes. Are you good? Yes. Everything is just one word. Yes. ¿Qué piensas de la vida? What, are, what do you think about life? Bien. Yes. ¿Qué te pasa? What, what's going on with you? Are you feeling okay? Bien. Yes. ¿Por qué te portas así? Why, why did you have to do that? Ah. Ah. Eh. Ah. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, uh. uh, does that happen here in the United States as well? Yeah. Yo pensé que era solo en I thought that only happened in Colombia. Y hay que se mal. So there are many of our kids, you know, that they are doing bad things. La pregunta es, ¿tú lo sigues amando? And the question for you is this morning, do you still love them? Even if they are doing bad things, do you still love them? Claro que lo of course, amando. you still love them. Los amamos. We love them. Los amamos. We love them. Si tú los amas, so if you love them, más te ama, imagine papá, how much God loves you. Te ama a ti. He loves you. Te ama. He loves you. Diga conmigo, Say with me. Yo puedo Dar sin amor. I can give without love. Y no va a pasar nada. And nothing's going to happen. Pero jamás, But never, never, never. Jamás, never. Cuando yo amo, siempre doy. When you love, you give. Diga porque el amor es una acción. Because love is an action. Tú no puedes llegar a decirle, oh pastor, te amo. So you can't go to the pastor and say, oh pastor, I love you. Se queda and just like you know I love you okay Cuando tú das, when you give dice lo cuanto lo amas. then you're saying how much you love that person Te lo voy a poner de otra I'm going to say it in another word what I give dice de mi amor por ti. talks about the love that I have for you tú no puedes ir a la calle so you cannot go out there y recoger las flores esas que produce lo de la, lo de la el pasto en la calle. And get you know some flowers you know from anywhere. Igual donde tu esposa le dices te amo mi amor. And then you go back home and you come to your wife and say oh I love you ella my va, love. Ella va a mirar las flores y and te she va a mirar look at those flowers and she will say. Esto no 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 te costó nada. I mean you didn't pay nothing for this. <laughs> no te cuesta nada. It didn't cost you nothing. Pero cuando tú vas y buscas el mejor regalo. But when you go, you know, and you bought her the best las, las of the best. Flores. The best flowers. Ella, ella te... oh, she will go crazy. Se oh. vuelve loca. Mi esposa me dice. My wife tells me. Mi amor. My love. Tú sabes que yo no te pido nada. You know that I, I don't ask you nothing. Solo una cartera anual. I only ask you for one bag a year one purse Solo una. just one y le digo, sí. and I tell her yes I know Pero Louis Vuitton. but it's a Louis Vuitton purse una. just one Pero en una. but with that one una. just one And when I go and when, when I want to buy something for her, yo le digo, Tú sabes que te amo. I tell her, you, you know I love you. Esto es para ti. And I brought this for you. Porque el amor Because love, se muestra. you, you got to put action into ha love. Jacob, Jacob, le hizo una tunica. Jacob, you know, he made a tunic for his son. A su hijo. He made a tunic for his son. Lo because he loved him. Era de 
It has all colors in it. Era lo mejor. It was the best of the best. Y le puso la tunica. And he gave him a tunic. Come here, Pastor. Y, y le dijo, te amo. What he was saying is, son, I love you. Te amo. I love you. Cada vez que vea la tunica, each time that you wear this, debes saber que te amo. You gotta know that I love you. Y eso produjo que los demás le tuvieran envidia. So everybody got angry because porque, of that. Porque lo que Dios te da because what God gives you es demasiado valor para ti. It has so much value for you. Vale demasiado. It has so much value. Dios dice. God says. Jesús. Jesus. Pídeme lo que quiera. Ask me whatever you need. Y yo te lo doy. And I will give it to you. Porque te ama. Because he loves you. No le pidas cosas pequeñas. Don't ask him for little things, small things. Pídele cosas grandes. Ask him big things. Esta mañana pídale cosas this grandes. This morning ask for big things. Y él te da la túnica. He gave him a tunic. Diga, la túnica. Say with me, the tunic. Representa. Represents. El valor de Dios para the mí. The value that God gives me. Lo que yo valgo para Dios. The value in my life for God. O sea, es la túnica. That's the tunic. Eh, diga, hay dos cosas. There are two things. Precio. Price. Y valor. And value. Dígalo. Say with me, price. And valor. Value. Precio es lo que la gente piensa de ti. Price is what people think about you. Valor en lo que Dios piensa de ti. But value is what God thinks about you. Vamos de nuevo. I'm gonna say it again. Diga valor. Say with me value. En lo que Dios. Is what God. Piensa de thinks mí. Thinks about me. Precio. Price. Es lo que la gente. Is what people think. Piensa de ti. About me. Cuando Dios te da valor. So when God gives you value. Te da valor. He gives you value. Ya no te importa lo que la gente you don't piense care de ti. anymore about what people think about you. Cuando tú tienes valor, when you have value, entiendes la túnica, and you have the tunic, la túnica, the tunic que el padre te da, that the father gives you, es valor. That means value. Valor. Value. Te ama. He loves you. Te ama. He loves you. Si yo no te amo, if I don't love you, no te importa. You don't care. Porque tú tienes valor. Because you already know el valor del padre the value that the Father has for your life. ¿Sabe qué necesita nuestra juventud? You know what our children valor. needs? They need to know ¿Sabe qué the value nosotros? they have. Valor. They need to understand that. Cuando yo tengo valor, because when I understand the value in my life, nadie me puede poner precio. No one can tag me with a price. Nadie me pone precio. No one. Porque yo no valgo por because lo que la persona dice. My value is not what people says about me. Yo valgo por lo que él dice. My value is what God says about me. Yo algo. Entonces cuando ella tiene valor, so when she understands that, todo lo que ella da es bueno. Everything that she gives away is good. ¿Sabe cómo sé cuánto me aman mis hijos? Do you know how, when I know how much my children loves me? Por lo que me dan. Because of what they give me. ¿Sabes cómo sé yo cuánto amas tú a Dios? You know how I know how much you love God? No por cuántas lágrimas derramas aquí. No for how many tears you cry in a service. No por cuántos gestos haces. No for how many times you raise your hands in church. Sino cuánto estás dispuesto. But how much are you willing a dar a Dios? To give. Dios nunca va a necesitar de ti. He will never need something from you. Nunca. 
he will never need something from you. Pero una manera de responder But a way to respond a ese amor his love es dando. is when you give. Quiero que leas algo I want you to read something que a mí me llamó la atención. that really, you know, uh, I really like it. Malachias 1.6. Malachi 1.6. No, 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 3.10 ni nada de eso. Malachias 1.6. 1.6. Malachi 1.6. Y mire lo que dice. Look what it says. El hijo honra al padre. The children honor the parents. El siervo honra a su señor. The servant honors his lord. Léalo por favor. Ok, ahí está. A son honors his father and a servant his master. If then I am the father, where is my honor? Ah, uh, ¿dónde está mi no, temor? No. ¿Cuál es dónde está su referencia? ¿A quién le dice eso? A Who ustedes is he sacerdote. talking to? Y dice, ¿en qué nosotros no te hemos honrado? Where is my reverence? In en, what way have we despised your name? En que ustedes desprecian mi nombre you are rejecting my name that's what he's saying I one way have the we despise your name ustedes desprecian you are rejecting me el versículo 7 verse 7 dice it says es importante esa parte en que ofrecéis sobre mi altar Pan inmundo. It says you offer defiled food on my altar. ¿Dónde hemos menospreciado? Where, where did we reject you? Escuche. Listen to this. La mesa del Señor. The table of the Lord. Era donde las personas ponían su ofrenda. It was the table where people would bring their offerings. Cualquiera da. So, any anyone can give. Pero otra cosa es dar por amor. But there is another thing when you give cuando with tú, love. Cuando tú valoras lo que Dios ha hecho en tu vida. When you understand what God has done in your life. Tú no das lo peor. You don't give just whatever. Tú das lo mejor. You give your best. A Dios le you da lo mejor. You give the best of the best to God. Si, si soy capaz de dar lo mejor. So if I'm able to give the best. Entonces voy a darle lo mejor a mis hijos. Then I'm going to give the best to my children. A mi esposa. To my spouse. A mi pastor. My wife, my pastor. A la gente donde yo estoy. The people that are around me. Porque yo amo. Because I love. Ustedes menosprecian mi altar. You defile. En que pre, en que pensáis que la mesa de Jehová es despreciable. And you think the table of the Lord is contemptible. La mesa del Señor es despreciable. En otra palabra dice, no, yo no creo eso. In other words, what he's saying is, you are rejecting me. Eh, no, eh, a la hora de la ofrenda se hace el que no es. In other words, you're saying, you know, by the time that the offering is, it, it, it's, it's been taken, you know, you're saying, ah, oh, well, I don't need to give. A la hora de la ofrenda se va para el baño. At the time of the offering, then you want to go to the bathroom. Porque no tiene valor. Because you don't have any value. Porque si hay valor, because if there is value, tú le darás lo mejor al Señor. You will give the best to the Lord. Tú no tienes problema para pagar 100 dólares para You don't have un, any problems para pagar unos tickets en Orlando. Paying a hundred dollars to go to a theme park in Orlando. Tú no tienes problema para eso. You don't have any problems with it. Pagas 200 dólares fast pa, fast fast pass. Creo que you pay 200 dollars if you want a fast pass. No tienes problema para hacer una hora la fila. And then you're you're making a line for one hour. Al sol. Sun, it's just burning you. Una hora esperando. And you're for you're, you're out there for one hour just waiting. Una hora. One hour. Para subirse 30 segundos. For 30 seconds in a roller coaster. Hello. Hello. Ah! Yeah. Una hora. One hour. Y aquí tiene problema. But you have a problem. Cuando se pasa diez minutos el culto. When the service goes ten minutes after time. Aquí estás pendiente del reloj. You are watching you know, all the time. Now. What time is it? What time is it? ¿A qué hora se acaba? What time, I mean, they say it was going to be over. Vamos. ¿A qué hora se acaba? It was going to be over five minutes. Predicador, ago. stop. Come on, preacher. Stop. ¿Será que tú lo amas? Do you really love him? 
Pero en Orlando. But in Orlando. Una hora. For one hour. Después de caminar ocho horas. After walking for eight hours around the park. Y llega el culto aquí. And then you come to the service. ¿Tú crees que lo amas? Do you think you love him? Porque él sí te ama. Because he loves you. Porque él sí te ama. Because he loves you. Sí te ama. Yes, he loves you. Él te ama. He loves you. Hija. Daughter. Él te ama. He loves you. Te ama demasiado. He loves you so much. Te ama demasiado. Te ama demasiado. He loves you. Te ama. He loves you. Te ama demasiado. He loves you. Is that your mother? Dile madre. Tell her mother, mom. Yes. Tell her mom. Mom. I love you. I love you. Él nos ama. He loves us. Te ama. He loves you. Quiero terminar esta reunión. I want to. Preguntándote hoy. I want to end this service, and I want to ask you something. Diciéndote hoy. I want to tell you this. ¿Qué es lo que más amas? I want to ask you, what do you love more? Tu negocio. Your business. Tu empresa. Your company. O al Dios que te dio la empresa. Or God, which is the one that gave you your company. O que te dio el trabajo. Gave you the job that you have. O que te dio lo que tú tienes. Gave you everything that you have. ¿Qué amas tú? ¿A quién amas más? Who do you love the most? Un día Dios me dijo. One day God told me. ¿Cuánto me amas, Gustavo? He asked me, how much you love me, Gustavo? Todo, Señor. I said, I love you with all my heart. Te with amo. everything that I have, I love you. ¿Estás seguro? And he said, are you sure? Sí, Señor. I said, yes, Lord. Tu vida. Your life. You will, yes, yes, I'll give you my life. Tómala. Take it. Amen. Amen. ¿Estás seguro que me are you sure that you love me? Sí. I said, yes, 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 Lord. Quiero que agarres el carro y lo siembres. So take your car and give it to me. Ay, no, 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 no. I said, no, Lord, no, no. I mean take my life Pero no mi carro. my life belongs to you but not my car Toma mi vida, take pero my no, life no mi billetera. but not my pocket not my money y yo me puse a llorar. so I start crying ¿Por qué? Pero mi carro, ¿por qué? why you need my car había durado tres años para tenerlo. For three years, you know, I was waiting Muy for that car. Muy difícil tener carro It allá. was very difficult to have a car in Colombia. Veinte años atrás. Twenty years ago. I'm talking about twenty years ago. Todos los días salía y cogía el carro y le decía te amo. And I used to go out every day, you know, drive my car, and I, I would say I love you, car. I love you. Y me dijo, ¿verdad me amas? So one day he asked me, sí, Do you really love me? God Entonces, asked me. Dame ese carro. So he told me, give me your car. Dios no necesita un carro. He doesn't need a car. Dios quería saber en dónde había puesto mi amor. He just wanted to know where my heart was. Y yo agarré lo que amaba. So I took what I loved. Y lo puse en el altar. And I brought it to the altar. Una vez llegó una niña. One day this little girl came. Como tú. Like you. Con un perro. With a dog. En el altar. She brought it to the altar. And I asked, you know, my people, I said, well, where's that dog doing in the church, in the sanctuary? Vino, Get him out of here. Y vino el hermano y me dijo, es que la niña sembró el perro. And one person came and told me, well, that, that little girl is giving away his dog. He's giving him as an offering. Y yo dije, no, pero... And I said, wow, no. Llamé a la mamá y le dije, so I called her mom and said, what's happening here? ¿Qué pasó? Dijo, no, lo que pasa es que esta mañana la niña se levantó y dijo, mamá, que lo único amigo aquí What happened is, you know, that this morning she woke up and she asked me, mom, 
you know, tell me everything that, you know, that is in this house that belongs to me. And her mom said, well, the only thing that belongs to you is your dog. Y el, y ella dijo, ¿Puedo hacer lo que quiere, ¿puedo so she, she asked me, you know, so I can do whatever I want with my dog. And she said, yes. Su papá se había ido de la casa. Her dad left them. Y dijo, el pastor dijo, and, and the little girl said the pastor said el profeta dijo, the prophet said que si yo doy, if I give lo que me cuesta, what, what, it, what it really belongs to me voy a poner el amor de and Dios what it hurts me por encima de todo. I'm, I'm putting God's love over y Dios everything me va in my dar life and God will respond ese amor de mi papá otra vez. my prayer for my father va a ser un milagro. and he's going to bring my father back y yo creo al profeta. and I believe what the prophet said yo creo al profeta. and I believe what he said y en la mañana se levantó. so that morning she woke up y, y la mamá dice, and her mom told me que bañaba al perro, lo that she bathed you know, her dog a lavar. she bathed him y decía, Tú eres una and, and she was saying to him you are my offering this morning Te amo. I love you Pero no eres mío. but you don't belong to me eres para Dios. you belong to God y lo trajo bañado a, and a la she altar. brought that dog to the altar Eso me a mí. and you know that moved my heart that day y dije, Ahora, ¿qué hago con el perro? and I was like what am I going to do with this little dog now Así que yo lo iba a devolver. So I was going to give it back to her. Y el Señor me dijo, no lo And hagas. God told me, don't do it. Porque esa es la fe de Because ella. that's her faith. Entonces yo cogí el perro. So I took the dog. Voy, le dije, bueno, ya la iglesia tiene un perro, así que. And I said, okay, so now church, we have a dog. Un hermano se levantó en la parte so de atrás. So one brother stood up in the back of the building. Le dije yo a la niña, ¿por qué quieres dar el perro? Me dijo, porque quiero que mi papá regrese. And I asked that little girl, you know, why are you giving away your dog? And she said, I want my father to come back Pero home. Pero yo estoy cansada. But I'm tired. Que no tengo estudio. That I, I, I can go to school. Quiero cumplir sueños. I, I have dreams that I want y to fulfill. siempre dicen que no hay dinero. And, and my mom always tells me, we don't have any money to do that. Es todo lo que tengo. So, so I'm, I'm praying for my dad and for money, finances. That's everything I have. Entonces vino un hombre en la parte so that man stood up in the back of the building Apostle, and he said Apostle ¿Puedo comprar el perro? can I buy that dog from you? Uh, claro. and I said yes ese, yes, ese perro vale. yes but, but it's very expensive Entonces, me ofreció una buena cantidad. so he offered me a good, good amount ¿Puede llevarse el perro? and I said come take your dog Se fue con el perro por la mitad de la he came he took the dog with him Se devolvió. he came back Llamó a la niña. He called that little dijo, girl and he said, lo que tú diste como semilla, What Dios you te lo gave da como cosecha. as a seed, God is giving you back as a harvest. Tómalo. Take him back. Y yo sentí en mi espíritu. And I felt in my spirit. Saqué dinero. You know, and, and I took some money out. Y lo puse en su mano. And I gave it to the little girl. Toda la iglesia empezó a poner dinero en, en ella. Now everybody, you know, all the church was Toda coming la... to the altar and giving her money as well. Ese día. That day. Ese día. That day. En la noche. At night. El ujier, el, el, el ujier vino y me dijo, Apóstol, One of the ushers came and told me, Apostle. Imagínese con quién vino la niña. Uh, do, do you know who she came with tonight to the service? El papá llegó esa noche. Her father came back home that same day and they went to church that night. I love you. Escucha. So listen. Cuando tú das a Dios. When you give to God. Dios te va a sorprender. Dios you will te... never lose again. Te va a sorprender. He will surprise you. Cuando tú das a Dios. When you give to God. Tú. Vas a ser sorprendido. You will be surprised. ¿Por qué no abrazas a tu esposo, a tu esposa, a tus hijos? Vamos. A... Come on. Hug your spouse, your husband, your wife. Your children, whoever is with you this morning. Un minuto y dígale, Just Señor, for one minute and say, Lord, te amo. I love you. Dígale, Señor, te say, amo. Lord, I love you. Yo te amo. I love you. Te amo. I love you. Necesito de ti. I need from you. Necesito de ti. I need from you. Señor, God, te amamos. We love you. Ahora pregúntele. ¿Qué quieres que demos hoy? So ask your wife or your husband, your children. ¿Cuál es tu semilla hoy? How much are we going to give this morning? What aprende, is your seed? Aprende esto. Cuando tú honras lo que ves. When you honor what you see. Lo que no ves te bendice. What you don't see will bless you back. Tus pastores son una respuesta de Dios para ti. Your pastors are an answer from God 
to you ellos te aman. because they love you. Nunca vas a ver aquí a tu pastor diciendo, hoy estoy desanimado. You will never see your pastor here in the front saying, oh, I don't want to be here this, here this morning. Pero siempre vas a verlo con una sonrisa. You will always see, see him smiling. Eso no quiere decir que no necesita. That doesn't mean that he doesn't go un abrazo. through difficulties or that he doesn't need a hug from una you. Palabra de aliento. A word from you. Dios siempre va a hacer cosas grandes. God will always do great things for Porque us amas. because he loves us. La pregunta que quiero hacerte hoy. So the question this morning is ¿Qué es lo que hoy Dios pone en tu espíritu what is God talking to your spirit para dar for you to give? ¿Qué vas a darle tú al Señor? What do you want to give God? Tú amas. How much you love en, him? En la noche vamos a mm -hmm. okay. We're going to pray for you tonight. En la noche, tonight. tonight. <laughs> Dame. Yo quiero, yo quiero que me de unos sobres. We, we need some envelopes. Dame unos sobres. Si Dios habló a tu espíritu, so if God spoke to your spirit this morning, quiero que, que pongas esos sobres aquí. I want you to put those envelopes right here. No. Hey, thank you. Tú eres un hombre de visión. You, ya me you cuento. are a good man. Come on, yes. Many Ay, envelopes. Tienes yeah. aceite. Do you have some oil? Pastor, por favor, tenme estos sobres. Pastor, please help me. Los puedes tener en tu mano. Can you hold them, please? Yes. Padre, yo declaro. Father, I declare. Que hoy se desata. That today. A supernatural anointing is being released. De respuestas. Answers. De finanzas. Finances. Para tus hijos. For your children. Señor. Lord. El peor año. The worst year. Será el mejor año. Will become the best year. En el nombre de Jesús. In the name of Jesus. Cuando el mundo dice. When the world says. Que el mundo está mal. That we are in crisis. Tus hijos estarán bendecidos. Your children will be blessed. ¿Qué te pidió el Señor? What God asked you this Ven y morning. Toma ese sobre. Come and get your envelope, please. Right de la now. mano de tu pastor. Come on. Take it from your pastor's hands. Ven como familia. Come as a family. Y voy a pedir al pastor. And I'm going to ask your pastor. Que estemos orando. That we're going to be praying. Y abraza a tu esposo, tu esposa. Hug your wife, your husband. Y dile, and tell Dios nos ama. God loves us. Porque nos trajo un profeta hoy. Because he brought us a prophet this morning. Nos trajo un profeta. He brought us a prophet. Escucha algo como Stephanie. I hear the name of Stephanie. En cada culto voy a hablar de alguien. In each service I'm going to speak about someone. Como Billy. I hear the name of Billy as well. Voy a hablar de eso. Billy. Billy. Hoy es el día de tu milagro. Today is the day for your miracle. Hay sanidad para ti. There is healing for you. Sanidad para healing ti. for you. Te ama el Señor. God loves you. Te ama el Señor. God loves you. Te ama. God loves you. Y quiero que tú hoy le des al Señor lo mejor. I want you to give God the best. Por favor, no le des lo peor. Please don't give him just whatever. Si no tienes, if you don't have, no te preocupes. Don't worry. Dios te va a dar una semilla. God will give you a seed. Dios te va a dar una buena semilla. He will give you a good seed. Pero dale al Señor lo mejor. But give him the best. Por favor, no le vayas a dar lo peor. Please don't give him just dale leftovers. Lo mejor. Give him the best. Lo mejor. The best. Nunca le des lo peor. Never give him the leftovers. Porque porque lo que tú das dice cuánto amas. Because what you give speaks about how much you love him. 200 dólares, 300 dólares en Orlando no es nada. 200 dólares, 300 dólares en Orlando, that's nothing. Para ir a vacaciones necesitas 5 o 10 mil dólares. For you to go there, you need 5,000 dollars. Y, y no, te, y no te, te va a dejar más cansado cuando llegues. And you're going to be tired when you get back. Pero lo que tú siembras en But la obra. But whatever you sow this morning in this church. Te va a traer cosecha para ti. That will bring you a harvest. Quiero orar en la noche por ti. I want to pray for you tonight. 
Los quiero mucho. I Pastor, love you. ore Pastor, por ellos. Pray. Come on, let's give, let's give the Lord a big hand clap.